My God. Serif Rattle. I've raised the Rue. One hundred dollars. I just unbelievable, guys. You. Wow. We tonight we have raised over seven hundred dollars for charity. You guys are absolutely absolutely exceptional human beings. Every single one of you. F that is absolutely nuts. Absolutely nuts. Um, what are we sat at currently? $1,006. That is absolutely exceptional. Hi guys, how are you going today? It is wonderful to be back with you. And uh, man, part of the reason it is so wonderful to be back with you is as you can see from the clip at the start of the stream, we successfully um, over our Twitch fundraiser managed to get together over a thousand dollars for wires, um, which is just absolutely incredible. I think our final total was um, $1,026 dollars or something like that either way it was um absolutely exceptional i think when when i first set the goal of raising a thousand i thought eh, we probably won't hit it but i'll be fine if we raise over 500 i was like in my mind i was happy if we if we reached over 500 in donations um so to massively exceed that um i guess my own personal expectation from that um, because of you guys is absolutely amazing. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I've made the donation earlier today, which was a pretty crazy, um, awesome feeling. Um, I think the a total, the final total um, that we ended up with, um, or the final total that I sent off to Wise was 1,300 Australian dollars, um, which is, I did say that uh, for every dollar that you guys donated, I would donate 25 cents um, to every dollar. Um, and since we ended up slightly over 2,000, oh, sorry, 1,000, I kicked in 250 or so of my own money. And, um, and then I just rounded it up to, to 1,300 because otherwise it was just a really ugly number. Um, so yeah, I've sent that off today. It's absolutely fantastic. It's going to go towards a great cause, um, help out all of the native Australian animals um, in New South Wales. And um, yeah, it, it's a great cause. So thank you very much, guys, um, to everybody who donated, to everybody who you know chipped in, uh, spread the word, and just hung out in the streams. It means a lot to me, and it means a lot um, to to Wise as well. And um, the other big thing that I've been doing, uh, and part of the reason why this video is so late compared to when we finished up this fundraiser, is that um, what I decided at the end of it, because there were so many really generous people, is that I wanted to, as a token of my personal appreciation for you guys and the people who did make very sizable contributions, um, I decided that anything over fifty dollars would um, I would draw them a very own their very own Drongo animal picture of an animal of their choice. Um, some of you might know that I do love drawing. I do love, um, you know, doing sketches and all that kind of thing. Uh, and I have been slowly chipping away at it. it. I've been so busy, it's taken me much longer than I thought it would. And uh, I was hoping to get it done before, all of them done before I made this video. But um, unfortunately, um, in typical Drongo fashion, I think um, these things just take much longer than I always anticipate. And uh, as such, the, the delays are uh, always longer. And I, I just don't, I, I just don't have very good um, time management, apparently. Uh, so yeah, it's a work in progress. I'm hoping to get them done in the next few weeks. Um, I've still got about a dozen uh, pictures left to do. Uh, so it's going to be yeah, just a matter of chipping away at them. But yeah, uh, I will send the, all of these pictures out to um, the people I've already been in contact with um, in, in not, uh, some nice little frames, hopefully, and uh, with a nice little message on the back as well. Uh, and like I said, just a token of my uh, very sincere appreciation for you guys and um, what you've helped, helped, uh, helped raise money for. It's a fantastic cause. So yeah, so that's a, that's a work in progress at the moment. We've got a lot of stuff on. Um, we also have um, 
Uh, we also have a whole bunch of stuff happening on the stream over the next few weeks. Next year is going to be a massively exciting year. I'm really hyped for it. Uh, we've got a lot of stuff on the books, a lot of stuff planned, and I hope you can join me there. Uh, for the next little while on my on, on Worm, um, we are going to be do- focusing on getting my final personal goal done now. Um, I just need to get wine, uh, 5,000 kilograms of wine made. Uh, the other week, um, or a few weeks ago now, uh, I went over and Jake Rivers and his crew made me a rare caravel. I'll put a video of that at the end of this. Um, they made me a rare cherrywood caravel and holy moly, it looks amazing. Um, it's, yeah, so that's pretty much all that's going to be going on in Worm is just me focusing on getting that done because of course personal goals will be ending at the end of January or the start of February rather. So there is a time limit set on it now. So TikTok, TikTok. Uh, otherwise guys, I think that's it. Keep an eye out on the YouTube channel. Um, in the next day or so, I am going to be posting a best of, uh, video on the Twitch highlights, everybody's favorite Twitch clips, um, from the last, you know, nine, nine months or so of streaming that we've been doing this. So yeah, keep an eye out for that. It's going to be cracker. I've been sorting through clips all morning and it's going to be so funny, so funny. So uh, catch you there. And um, yeah, thanks again, guys. And yeah, like I said, I'll pop in the little clip of making this cherry wood caravel at the end of this. See us. So I'm finally, I've made it over onto Exodus and Jay Rivers and co have managed to put me together my caravel order that I have been after for quite some time now for my personal goals missions. Here he is, the man, the myth, the legend, looking very schnazzy in his little black hat there. We've got an unfinished caravel here. It's actually turned out to be rare. Holy shit, it's going to be amazing. And now we get to see how many actions it's going to take me to add a peg, a singular peg, a singular raspberry wood peg as well at that. I don't even know. I I don't even know what raspberry wood actually is going to look like. I don't know how long this is going to take me to actually attach it because I have piss poor building um or shipbuilding specifically, it is absolutely woeful. So I'm hoping this peg isn't going to end up damaging so badly that we can't actually use it. Because that would be uh, pretty unfortunate. Um, and Jake, as if reading my mind, is just saying, if it gets too damaged, I have more. Man, this guy, he's, he's all over it. He's prepared. He's well prepared. So I guess now we just sit back and wait and see how long it will take. Three hours later. Hooray! We finally did it. Oh my god. Holy shit, this is red. It's so red. Oh my god, it's so pink and red. Let's park it in front of this bit here, going along like so. Oh my goodness. It, it, it's like, once you get it outside, it has like a dark reddishness to it, which is really cool and kind of unique, I think. I don't think I've ever seen a, a caravel quite this color before. And there's weird little accentuations of other colors of wood on there that are actually kind of cool too. But holy shit, I love it. Man, that is a nice looking caravel, guys. A nice looking rare caravel. That is going to be definitely going to be a prize in my little boat collection. Oh my word. That is, oh, that is gorgeous. God, I was originally going to make this out of Orlando wood, but when I arrived, Jake Rivers said, nope, the girls have decided that you're going to make it out of raspberry wood. And I'm like, I mean, sure. If that's what if that's what the girls have said, sure, let's do it. And my God, apparently they were spot on because this was a brilliant decision. Look at that bad boy there. Damn. So big thank you to Jake Rivers and his crew for putting this together for me. I know it um, it wasn't the quickest thing to do, but these guys did it. 
within a day of me putting in the order, they were just like, yeah, sure. Sure, Drongo, we'll, we'll make a caravel. We'll make you an Amphirish caravel so you can get your personal achievements. And, I mean, I said, yep, yeah, no worries. No, not a major rush. It's probably going to be a little, a few days before I can pick it up. Later that day, they delivered. They said, you know, Drongo, head on over whenever you're ready. It is, uh, it's all done. And not only is it done, it's rare. My goodness, I am absolutely in love with this boat right now. This is an absolutely magnificent, magnificent boat. Ooh-wee.